but ever and a day the radio and the telephone and the movies that we know may just be passing fancies and in time may go but oh my dear our love is here to stay together we're going a long long way in time the rockies may crumble gibraltar may tumble they're only made of clay but
Like a dream to me that somehow came true, and I know tomorrow will still be the same. Cause we've got a life of love. We've got a little fist. Our Savior has declared that a man shall leave his father and mother and cleave unto his wife. By his apostles, he has instructed those who enter into this relation to cherish a mutual esteem and love, to bear uh, it with each other in uh, uh, adversity and trouble, to pray for and encourage each other in the things which pertain to God, and to live together as the heirs of the grace of life. Let us pray. Almighty and ever-blessed God, whose presence is the happiness of every condition and whose favor hallows every relation, we beseech thee to be present and favorable unto these thy servants, Richard and Patricia, that they may be truly joined in the honorable estate of marriage in the covenant of their God. As thou hast brought them together by thy providence, Sanctify them by thy spirit, giving them a new frame of heart fit for their new estate, and enrich them with thy grace, whereby they may enjoy the comforts, undergo the cares, endure the trials, and perform the duties of life together as becometh Christians under thy heavenly guidance and protection. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, amen.
Richard, wilt thou have Patricia to be thy wife, and wilt thou pledge thy troth to her in all love and honor, in all duty and service, in all faith and tenderness to live with her and cherish her according to the ordinance of God in the holy bond of marriage. Will you? I will. Patricia, wilt thou have Richard to be thy husband? And wilt thou pledge thy troth to him in all love and honor, in all duty and service, in all faith and tenderness to live with him and cherish him according to the ordinance of God in the holy bond of marriage. Will you? I will. Who giveth this woman to be married to this man? We are surrounded today by the music of love for the marriage of Richard and Patricia. Marriage is not a ceremony, but an ongoing commitment. No pastor or priest can create a marriage because a marriage truly is nothing except the promises made and kept by two individuals. It requires great trust to pledge oneself to a lifetime with another person. Today, Richard and Patricia demonstrate their faith and trust by pledging their love to each other. At this time, would Uncle Sal please step to the lectern? You're wearing a mic. Yeah. I have been asked by Richard and Tish to come up here and say a few words. In view of the happy occasion, the subject I've chosen from the Bible is love. It is from the Corinthians. Love is always patient and kind. It is never jealous, never boastful or conceited. It is never rude or selfish. It does not take offense and is not resentful. Love takes no pleasure in the other people's sins, but delights in the truth. It is always ready to excuse, to trust, to hope, and to endure whatever comes. In short, there are three things that last, hope, faith, and love. And the greatest of these is love. You'll face each other. Okay. <clears throat> I, Richard, take thee, Patricia. I, Richard, take thee, Patricia. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. And I do promise and covenant. And I do promise and covenant. Before God and these witnesses. Before God and these witnesses. To be thy loving and faithful husband. To be thy loving and faithful husband. In plenty and in want. In plenty and in want. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. I, Patricia, take thee, Richard. I, Patricia, take thee, Richard. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. And I do promise and covenant. And I do promise and covenant. Before God and these witnesses. Before God and these witnesses. To be thy loving and faithful wife. To be thy loving and faithful wife. In plenty and in want. In plenty and in want. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. As long as we both shall live as long as we both shall live. Let us pray. Bless, O Lord, these rings and they who give them, that they may abide in thy peace and continue in thy favor until their life's end, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. <coughs> Put it on. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm holding it. Here we go. Did you? Uh... No. <laughs> no. I forgot. <laughs> okay. With this ring I wed you. With this ring I wed you. For today, for tomorrow, and for all the years to come. For today, for tomorrow, and all the years to come. Please wear it as a sign of my love. Please wear it as a sign of my love. And a notice to all the world. And a notice to all the world. That you have chosen me to be your husband. That you have chosen me to be your husband. Oops. Okay. 
With this ring I wed you. <clears throat> With this ring I wed you. For today, for tomorrow, and for all the years to come. For today, for tomorrow, and for all the years to come. Please wear it as a sign of my love. Please wear it as a sign of my love. And a notice to all the world. And a notice to all the world. That you have chosen me to be your wife. That you have chosen me to be your wife. By the promises they've made, Richard and Patricia have demonstrated their belief in love, in marriage, and in each other. They ask now for the blessing of all who have witnessed their vows. Let us pray. Most merciful and gracious God, of whom the whole family in heaven and earth is named, bestow upon these thy servants the seal of thine approval and thy fatherly benediction, granting unto them grace to fulfill with pure and steadfast affection the vow and covenant between them made. Guide them together, we beseech thee, in the way of righteousness and peace, that loving and serving thee with one heart and mind all the days of their life, they may be abundantly enriched with the tokens of thine everlasting favor in Jesus Christ, our Lord who taught us when we pray together to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Now by the authority committed unto me as a minister of the Church of Christ, I declare that Richard and Patricia are now husband and wife according to the ordinance of God and the law of the state. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, amen. Whom therefore God hath joined together let no man put asunder. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace, both now and in the life everlasting. Amen. Thank you. <laughs> I'm stuck on you. My earring. Okay. Thank you. We gotta go back. Thanks, man. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Congratulations. You did great. Wow. Yes. Congratulations. Thanks. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Brother. Thank you. Always wanted a brother. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks very much. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thanks, you're great. <laughs>
Ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to invite you back to your tables. Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a nice round of applause for Jeff. Why don't you just put this down here? Thank you, thank you. Can I get this like that? Let me set this down like this. Hi. That's nice of you to say hi back. That's very nice. Uh, most of you I don't know. A lot of you I do know. Okay, I have to stand on the video. I just advised I have to stand on the video. So the left part of you, I'm not, I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to see or talk to, but you'll hear my voice. I'm going to try and make this toast as short as possible. And I've written it in the last five minutes, so just like bear with me if I have to read my notes, okay? Thank you. This is to my best most loving friend Richard and to his best now best and most loving friend Patricia I have known Richard for about 10 wonderful years now I have known Tish for about four I have never seen a couple so full of care and love for each other sincere warm infectious and beautiful full of the spirit of love that God put us all here to one day find. They certainly found it. However, regrettably, finding it is not all there is. Keeping it is all there is. They must keep it, they must nurture it, and they must deepen their feelings for each other. That's the true conquest. May Richard and Tish know each other in only those special ways that two people who share a life together develop. May they sanctify their love with each other by allowing their own independence of each other's spirit. May they comfort each other deeply when life hurts. May they soar like eagles together when God blesses them with goodness and happiness. May they truly hear rather than listen to the stories of each other's lives. May they securely, warmly, and tenderly devote themselves to the families that were once separate, but are now united in their own special family. May they have the compassion, wisdom, and selflessness to indulge each other in their own faults and frailties as human beings. May they love each other eternally. From my heart, Mazel tov to Richard, la vita e fata così così, and enjoy it. To Tish and everyone else here, their families, friends, and all, may the wind always be at your back, and may the ground rise up to meet you. God bless them, their marriage, their families, and God bless us all, everyone. Thank you.
Alright guys, we're going to have to play everybody running up in Gloria out there. We still need some more party people on the dance floor. Come on! Here we go!
life and come on out to Hopog and get away from Nassau County. Dick and Tish, much happiness to you both. We're very fond of you as we are of your wonderful sister Ellie. Much happiness to you both. Love you. Hi Dick and Tish, this is the greatest. I just love you both. Have a wonderful life together. Stay happy always the way you are right now. Love you. To me, you'll always be my little Dickie, and I wish you much happiness and love for the rest of your life. Yeah, congratulations, and this is a very nice party. Thank you. Congratulations, Dick. You deserve the best. Good luck. Thank you very much for inviting me, and I wish you the best of everything in the world. Dick, they got me with a mouthful, Dick. Tish, good luck, happiness always. Hi, Uncle Richard. Hi, Tish. I really don't like talking into these things because I never know what to say. So I'm just going to say congratulations and we love you very much. Okay. Congratulations, Richard and Patricia. Lots of luck. Now you. Congratulations, Tish and Richard. Oh. Congratulations from Tish and Richard. When they want you to say something, I don't know what to say. Congratulations. Say a few thousand words. Congratulations to Richard, one of my favorite Davids and brothers. God bless him. Which end are you talking? <laughs> Congratulations to Tish and Richard and wish them many happy returns for many years to come. And if Richard doesn't turn out to be as good as he's supposed to be, my telephone number is 516-747. Here you are, dear. <laughs> Hi, Dick and Tish. We love you. And you're having a great time at your party. Hi. Hi, Rich. This is Mom. I'm so happy you found such a beautiful bride, and you're happy. You made all of us happy. Put that in your cleavage and talk. <laughs> is it on? It's on. All I can say is God is good. He brought two beautiful people together. May you always love each other and be kind to each other. It's a very lovely party. I'm glad to be here and I wish you nothing but happiness. Good luck with the tour. Okay. Richard and Tish. Lots of luck to you both, and be happy forever and ever. Congratulations, Patricia. This is your second mother from when you was a little girl. Your husband looks like he's going to take good care of you, and I hope he does. I love you, Tish. Uncle and Tish, I wish you lots of luck. I love you guys very much, and uh, the best. I just want to tell you, I'm glad to see you so happy, really am, it makes me feel good, again, and uh, I'm pretty inspired by it, so you guys, good luck to you, Tish, you're a wonderful girl, I always told my mother that when I grew up, I wanted to be just like you, so maybe, if I keep trying, maybe it'll happen. Give it back to me for a second, one second. Uncle, by the way, when football season starts, you want to make some money, listen to your nephew. Thank you. And if you see this tape before the wedding's over, get this guy out of here. <laughs> what do I do here? Just, just talk. Just talk. Just talk into it. Uncle Richard and Aunt Tish, I just hope you're as happy as you seem today. Not seem, are. Because you both really deserve it, and you both are really beautiful people. Oh, yeah. We all love you. Congratulations. You gotcha. forgot something, too. Congratulations, Mom. <laughs> Congratulations, Rich and Tish. I wish you much, much happiness. 
Hi, Uncle Rich and Aunt Tish. Just want to say that you two have to make the most beautiful couple I've ever seen, except for me and my girlfriend, maybe. <laughs> uh, best of luck and uh, happiness, and we'll see you later. Uncle Rich and Tish, I'm really, I'm really happy for you too. I think you're two beautiful people. I hope you have a really nice, long, happy life together. Enjoy every minute of it. Thanks. Hi, Richard. Hi, Tish. The light's shining right in my face, so I can't see what I'm doing. But congratulations. I love you both, and I'm proud of both of you. You're both going to be a part of my family soon. And um, that's it. Thank you. This is a beautiful wedding, and congratulations. Thank you. Richard and Tish, good luck. Congratulations. We do. Yes, I am. All right, I pass it. There you go. Congratulations, Dick and Tish. Well, you got to talk a little bit better than that. I was in the neighborhood, stopped in for a drink. Uh, who the hell are you people? Congratulations. C congratulations, Dick. Congratulations. Congratulations. Richard and Tish, we love you. Congratulations. Say Sandy, congratulations. Good luck. <laughs> I'd like to wish Richard and Tish the absolute much love and success in the future because they're the two greatest, best, happiest couple I've ever met. I love you both. Love from Herb and Murray and the dogs. Thank you, Herb and Murray and You're the welcome. dogs. Love you, Tish. And you look gorgeous. <laughs> I'm going to speak for uh, Rhoda and myself to both of you, but first, if I may, I just want to preface by saying, Dick, you're a truly amazing individual. And this I say the same thing. Right. Best to both of you. We you, love you both. You have risen out of the ashes in a fashion that is beyond imagination. It gives me such personal pride, as if you're my own son. And I have such joy for you. And in Trish, you found someone that you can have a very, very happy life. And that's the most important thing, because you got two boys out of this world, and with all of you going together in the same path, all you're going to have ahead for you is a lot of happiness, a lot of love. That's all that life is about. Good luck again. From Roy and Jan to Rich and Trish, all our best. We're glad that uh, we met both of you through Jeffrey, and you are newer friends in our lives, and looking forward to uh, getting to know you better <laughs> throughout the years. And we both wish you both much happiness, love, and a lifetime filled with joy. Our best to you, Roy and Jan. To Richard and Tish, I wish you the best and stay out of Korean restaurants. <laughs> With the cats. <laughs> Are you waiting for me? Listen, I already did this. I did this once. I did it in front of 180 people. I don't got to do this anymore. I love them. I told you about it. I had to have a good time. I had the best of lives. And I can't do it again. I'm not doing it again. Yeah, I'll do it a little bit again. All right. <laughs> uh, May they really do what I told them in this speech, and they really love each other dearly. And I know from my heart that they're going to have the best relationship. And someday, if I can find and do what they did, and conquer that inside love stuff, it'd be great for me. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. All right. All right, Daddy, I just want to tell you that I love you. I love your wife. I love your wife. Mwah. And I couldn't be happier for you or Tish. 1993 has proved to be a, the start of a great year, and I hope the good luck continues uh, from now on and forever. Okay? Nothing that would just really happy that they're together. That's good. Hi, I'm Pat. Hi, Richard. Welcome uh, to the family. 
We're, we're so just, happy. We're very happy that you're together, that you found each other. And right. many, many years of health and happiness. That's right. <laughs> Hi, Pat and Richard. Hi, Joe. Pat. Hi, Richard. It's Kenny. Just wanted to wish you all the happiness in the world, and you know, you guys have to like, you know, there'll be no more stomp stomping and no, no stomp more, stomping. Like, I owning the seat in front of the TV. You can't turn on the dishwasher while we're watching TV. But happiness always. Richard, you'll keep her in line. I know that. Hi, mom. Dad. Um, congratulations. I uh, love you both. And many happy years. Best of luck. Yeah, best of luck. Hi, Pat and Richard. Congratulations, and I wish you all the best and many, many years of happiness. Wait, give that back to me. Give back, give back no, wait. To Craig Watson. Hi. I just want to wish you both the best of luck. We both love you very much, and we wish you many, many years of happiness. Hi. We love you guys. We love you. Craig <laughs> Watson. No, I, I forgot, forgot, but, but if, if I can say, say that, I love, love you both, both and that's, that's it. it. <laughs> oh, Pat and Richard, uh, I want to wish you both wealth, happiness, and, uh, and lots of love throughout the house and the family and friends. Thank you for inviting me. Hi, we're the Scullies and uh, Cousin Tish and Cousin Richard, congratulations. And long life and happiness together. Thank you. Just keep it down here, she said. Just keep it down here. Congratulations, Tish and Richard. I don't know, but for some reason, everybody wants me to take my jacket off here at this wedding. Congratulations. <laughs> hey, guys. Am I got a question? No, you just talk to them. Hey, guys. Lots of luck. I wish you the best of everything that you can in life. See you soon. Hi, Pat Richard. We're so happy to be here, and we're so happy for you today. Hi, guys. Pat, Richard, we both love you a lot. And I was up all night writing the speech for Pat. This is special for you. I told you so, I told you so. Bye, hon. Hi, Pat and Rich. It's nice to know that there's always a Prince Charming lurking somewhere in the woodwork. <laughs> We wish you all good luck and success and happiness and no cavities. Hi guys. I'd like to wish you a long life and much happiness. Best wishes to both of you on your new wedding and we hope you have a long and happy life together. Thank you. I always say health, happiness and love. I really, really mean it. You two guys deserve the best. I gather nobody else wanted to say anything to you, Tish, but uh, congratulations. I hope you enjoyed uh, your lives together. Congratulations, Tish, and happiness. Lots of it. Congratulations to both of you. May ha you have many, many, many happy years.
want to wish you guys the best of everything. Have a wonderful, long life together. And, and I'm glad you invited me here. Believe it or not, I can say anything? Congratulations. Yeah, we're the great. Congratulations. Thanks for inviting us. Thanks for inviting us. Have a wonderful life together. Great party. Speak! Speak! Maid of Honor, speak! Matron of Honor, older matron of Honor. Old maid! Old maid! Old maid of Honor. What Tish, I love you and I wish you the best. And Richard. Okay. Richard and Trish, lots of luck, congratulations, and we love you. To Richard and Trish, may your love be as good as, as much as we love Richard. <laughs> All the best luck and thank you again for having us. Love, peace, and happiness always. Love you. A wonderful party. I'm glad I'm here. And lots of luck to you both. Well, as I the chin done. <laughs> Happiness always. We love you very much. But Tish and Richard, it was a wonderful, it is a wonderful wedding. We have a wonderful time. We're going to the Garden City Hotel. Richard, can you give me your uh, uh, number on the credit card because we're going to have a great time after this. And congratulations and have a wonderful honeymoon and do everything I would do. Anybody else want to say anything? That's it. I can't see it. Say something. I know. Well, I'm, I'm really shocked that I was invited. But being I was invited, all these people managed to have free seats. Well, one thing, we're good for big gifts. That you can be sure of. <laughs> uh, I think I'll pass. Tish and Dick, I wish you all the happiness. Look at the camera. Oh, I can't. Now talk. Where am I supposed to talk? I'm here? Yes, talk. All right. Tish. Like to hold on to this. That looks like a bomb. <laughs> it does. Right, now it Tish and Dick, I wish you bigger. all the happiness That's in the it. world. I'm so happy that you both are getting another chance at happiness, and I hope everything works out for you, and she'll be married another 50 years. Good luck. Our pleasure. Thanks for having us. Good luck. I just feel bad that now that Marilyn had a sexual experience with the microphone, I'm almost afraid to touch it. But anyway, Nick and Trish, nothing but the happiest and... and the glorious life together that you could ever imagine from everybody here. Good. I second whatever. Ah, I you. <laughs> <laughs> the name is Neil. 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 Lots of luck to you, Richard. We're all around and we're all finished. <laughs> say hello. <laughs> just hold on to it and say, don't say me that guy. Tish and Richard, I just want to say that thank you for having us. We're having a wonderful time. And I wish you a lifetime of happiness. A lifetime. I appreciate <laughs> it is a lifetime of happiness. Good luck and good, good luck and good what? Thank you. I wish you much, much happiness. Thanks for having us. I'm not too happy with the table you sat me at. But look, I know him for a long time. You don't know him as well as I do. They're terrible people. <laughs> Very sexual people. But I can't take so much. I have much, much happiness. All the luck in the world. Many happy years together. And my house guest, Neil and Tessie, are sleeping over tonight. And I'm a little concerned that Neil will break the door down. For me, for me. Dick and Tish, I'm the only Protestant person at this entire wedding. And I appreciate the Presbyterian Church and the service was wonderful. And we're having a great time and much happiness always. No, we got a minority. Let's go on. You must have got a minority. We have one token Christian here. <laughs> I mean, we have a put it here. Oh, yeah. I'm a little, I have one thing. I have one thing more to say. I'm a little confused as to who invited me. 
whether Ian invited me, John, or Dick, or Tish. So, at the end of the evening, come back to me, and I'll let you know who invited me. From the bottom of my heart, I wish you the best of everything. I look forward to the next 20 years of seeing you guys. You're next. Uh, Richard, my call phone number in case it's 3 o'clock in the morning. I don't give this out to anyone. It's 295-4480. And forget the number, but if you need a lift at 3 in the morning, you call me. 295-4480. Cindy, what would you like to say to Richard Landy? It was very nice meeting you. I enjoyed your wedding very much. <laughs> She's very beautiful, isn't she? She's very beautiful. I love her very much, Rich. I love her more than I love you, Richard. <laughs> something you'd like to say? I said something at the other time. <laughs> all right, Dick, enjoy St. Martin's. Lose all your money. Tish, have a wonderful time and a wonderful life. And God bless you both. Be happy. What can I say? But you guys are the best. Wish you the happiness, everything. Goodbye. Okay. Great. Congratulations. We wish you all the luck and happiness in the world. And we were the there when you. The bar mitzvah is beautiful. <laughs> really, this is the Goldstein bar mitzvah, isn't it? This isn't the Goldstein, the Goldstein bar mitzvah? It, oh, it is the gold team. Yeah. Right. We're great. We're, we're having a wonderful time. And Dick. Thank you. Where do you talk to Jim? Right there, wherever it is. Just go with Dick and Tish, thank you for inviting us, and may you have love, happiness, and health for the rest of your life. I'm so happy to be here at this lovely, lovely occasion. I want to wish Dick and Tish all the luck in the world. And speaking of weddings, this woman goes into the doctor's office. She says, doctor, doctor, did I leave my panties here? She says, no, I must have left them at the dentist. <laughs> Richard and Tish, we love you. This is one of the nicest affairs we ever went to. This is Neil Sowett. We met so Cousin Maureen. Okay. What? Cousin Maureen. Said, right. And we're having a wonderful time. It's a great table. I'm glad all my friends could be here. Would you like to, you know who this person is? This, this is John Patrick Gilligan. This is Tish's brother. Yo ho! <laughs> Do I press this? Hi, sweetheart. I didn't really mean it all those years ago when I told you I didn't want you, because I really did. And I'm so glad that you met Richard and that both of you are going to be so happy because the two of you are just made for each other. And it's wonderful. And I love you both. And I'm so happy for you. Here's Cousin Mo. Do you talk to Fred? I don't know. I didn't press. Hi, Tish and Richard. Best of luck and much happiness to you both. We love you. Oh, well, you know, uh, Richard and Richard and Tim, we're together. It was about a little over a year ago that we were sitting in our uh, living room. We're in the den out in California, and Richard showed us a tape similar to the tape that's being made right now uh, at your party about a year ago. We were both saying how funny it would be if we were all back in New York, and ironically, here it is a year later, and we're uh, once again starting a new phase of our life, as you're starting a new phase of your life, so we wish you uh, both the best, best. and uh, happy, 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 and all that sort of stuff, and, uh, and here's Judy. And here's Miss Judy Gallagher. Love to you guys. This is a very happy occasion, and we love you.
out there. Yeah, I'd like a horse and carriage. This I'll tell you, brother. You can't have one without the other. Love and marriage, love and marriage. It's an institute you can't disparage. Ask the local gentry. Say it's elementary. Try, try, try to separate them. It's an illusion. Try, 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 and you will only come to this conclusion. Love and marriage, love and marriage, go together like a horse and carriage. Dad was told by mother, you can't have one, you can't have none, you can't have one without the other. Try, try, try to separate them, it's an illusion. Try, try, try and you will only come. This conclusion, love and the marriage, love and marriage, they go together like the horse and carriage. Dad was told by mother, you can't have one, you can't have none. Easy, nice. Yes, yes, yes. Nice round of applause. Nice round of applause for Tish and Richard, ladies and gentlemen. That's for all you Al Bundy fans. <laughs> love and marriage, love and marriage. They go together like a horse and carriage. All right, Tish, do we have all the single ladies out there? Final check. We're going to ask you to turn around and everyone's going to help you to count to three. Are you ready, ladies? One, two, three. Sight.
time, ladies and gentlemen, we'll call upon Richard to have a very nice dance with his mom, Kitty. Let's have a nice round of applause for Richard and Kitty. Watch out, Kitty. Oh 
nobody but you. I'll be the only one if you should say we're through. Well, if you want to make me cry, that won't be so hard to do. And if you should say goodbye, I'll still go on loving you. Each night I ask the stars up above, why must I be a teenager in love? I cry a tear, nobody but you. I'll be a lonely one if you should say we're through. Well, if you want to make me cry, that won't be so hard to do. And if you should say goodbye, I'll still go on loving you. Each night I ask the stars up above, why must I be a teenager in love? 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 Ladies and gentlemen, nice round of applause for Herb. You know, Richard and I used to sing that song 33 years ago in Fresh Meadows. Cut the tape.
with Richard. For me, my time with her has been empowering, caring, and special. You are right. <laughs> it's not funny. She has always been the wind beneath my wings. Richard, you now will be blessed with that spirit, and combined you will have all that God has destined for you. May God bless your marriage. Just live it. Bless my friendship. And may your life together be as wonderful as you want it to be. Wish it to be and hope to be. I love you both. Bless you and your family forever. Mom, Richard, I want to wish you the best of luck and many, many years of happiness. And I just want to say I love you both. Ladies and gentlemen, let's round of applause for Craig, Linda, and Brian. couldn't be happy about this unity. Um, 1993 so far has proved to be a great year for my father and uh, I hope that all this love and happiness and I can't be happier with, uh, with a stepmom like Tish. So I hope uh, my new family and I can, you know, have many years of, uh, what? Happiness. Happiness is a good word. Tell us something about the boss for Jeff. For Jeff. Yeah, Jeff. Yeah. Thanks. Right here. Right here.
not that sexy. Hey, wait a minute. Listen, this isn't a shitty gift either. Did you talk to her? I don't know. I would just like to say, I would like to reiterate what I said before. Everybody in the world should be as happy as I am tonight, and we are tonight. And this is the most wonderful woman I ever met, and I just love you to death. Aww. And I'm proud to have you as my wife. Proud. <laughs> so good. Mm. I love you. I love you too. I love you very much, and I'm very proud to be your wife. Good. And I'm very happy. And I can't wait to get to St. Martin. <laughs> wave, you gotta wave. Goodbye, all. Thanks Goodbye. for coming. We had a wonderful wedding, and thanks all for being here. Oh.
Snowflake 